I'm a, a physician assistant, military trained. I went through the Army Academy uh, almost 22 years ago now. I'm um, originally uh, hailed from Chalmette, Louisiana, which is right outside of New Orleans, um, and did 20 years in the Army National Guard. Uh, retired in 2008. I think my, my path began in my early military career uh, when I trained uh, in San Antonio, Texas as an operating room technician. When Hurricane Katrina hit, uh, I volunteered to come down and uh, deploy to help the state and uh, decided to stay home. And when I transitioned to part-time uh, and ultimately retired, I'd already been working here uh, part-time in the emergency department at Cabrini and, uh, and this felt like family. And, uh, the rest is history. <laughs> I think it's very obvious here at Cabrini that their mission is to serve something greater than ourselves. It's not just a job. Um, it's not just about numbers and metrics. The, the leadership team here in the emergency department uh, has really been very progressive in thinking outside the box. Uh, but in doing that, we needed resources to do that. We needed additional nursing staff. We needed additional beds to put patients in. And uh, the Cabrini leadership has provided that. We want to know what we can do to make their next visit even better than this visit. So oftentimes, we'll give them a card during the visit and say, you know, uh, we want today to be exceptional, but we want next time to be even better. This organization, we're always striving to improve. We're never happy with where we are. My litmus test for every single patient, whether it doesn't matter if they're male or female, if they're black or white, is it, my litmus test is if this was my family, what would I want for them? If this was my brother or my sister or my grandmother, and it doesn't matter where they're from or what language they speak, uh, they, in fact, they don't even have to be nice. The core values of Christus, uh, it shines in everything they do, every decision they make, every process they put in, pro in place. Every meeting we have, every planning session, their vision is clear, uh, and it's the, it's the advance the Christian faith. You can learn medicine in school, you can learn the science and, the, and the, ma the math and the science and the medicine behind it, but the empathy, actually empathizing with people during their time of suffering, whether it's a, a patient or even a family member who's anxious about their loved one. Um, and I think that they, I think in that sense, it is important to a patient that we are faith-based because that's, that's at the core of everything we do.